Good day everyone. I welcome you to our computer science show. I still remain your presenter, Mr. Abdul Kader. Today with me, is the information communication technology specialist of our time, Mr. Amin H. Allahi Ismail. Mr. Amin H. Allahi Ismail, kindly introduce yourself. Thank you Mr. Abdul Kader. Good day everyone. I am Mr. Amin H. Allahi Accord Ismail, an information communication technology specialist from the capital city of Nigeria, Abuya. It's our pleasure to have you here. You are welcome, Mr. Abdul Kader. Today discussion will be on, Applications Areas of Information Communication Technology. Mr. Amin H. Allahi Ismail, how do we go about this topic? Okay, let's take it from this angle. Information communication technology has different types of applications for different fields. What are this filed and how it is applicable? Thank you. Mr. Abdul Kader. ICT has different types of applications for different fields. These fields are teleconferencing, video conferencing, telepresence, telecommunication and networking, telecomputing, messaging, information search, retrieval and archival, ICT based gadgets, mobile phone, computer, fax machine automated teller machine ATM and so on thank you mr. Amin H. Lahi Ismail I can see you are full of knowledge however we have to take the area one after the other so mr. Amin H. Lahi Ismail how will you explain teleconferencing as one of the field in ICT the word tele means distance the word conference means discussion consultation it be simply defined as the process of holding conference via telephone or network connection. Teleconferencing is the live exchange and mass circulation of information among several person and machine remote from one another, but linked by telecommunication system. Thank you. What of video conferencing? With video conferencing people can interact as if they were talking face to face with both images and sound relay in real time. Thus far video conferencing has been used in the following fields. Business distance learning, home offices, legal environment and telemedicine. Wow! This is interesting. What of telepresence? Telepresence is also called virtual presence, is a technique to create a sense of physical presence at a remote location using multimedia such as sound, vision and touch. Excellent! ICT is very interesting. Let's look at telecommunication and networking. Telecommunication is the process of sending and receiving electrical signal over a large distance by electronic means. A single telecommunication circuit consists of two stations, each equipped with a transmitter and a receiver. There are certain mediums of telecommunication systems such as coaxial cables, fiber optics, radio frequency and air etc. A telecommunication network is a network of nodes and links and the communication signal passes through one link to another. You are indeed a great ICT specialist. Please, what of the field of telecomputing? It is a generic, common term referring to the use of computers for communication. The term includes communication using computers linked either one-to-one -one or in networks of interlinked computers. The most common use of interlinked computers now is by the way of the Internet and Internet. Internet is a private network which serves a single organization, such as a corporation. Thanks you. Messaging is also one of the application areas of I. C. T. Please kindly explain. The most common forms of messaging are emails, paging, short message service (SMS), enhanced message service (EMS), multimedia message (MMS), and instant messaging. Thank you. What of information search, retrieval, and archival? Information retrieval is the science of searching for documents, information within documents, and metadata about document as well as that of searching relational databases in the World Wide Web. An archival information system consists of an organization of people and systems that has accepted the responsibility to preserve information and make it available for a designated community. Thank you. ICT-based gadgets is another application areas of ICT. Please kindly elaborate. A gadget is a small technological device or an appliance that has a particular function. Examples of ICT gadgets include computer, automated teller machine, ATM, dispensing machine, radio sets, television set, fax machine, telephone, GSM, etc. Thank you. How will you explain mobile phone as one of the application areas of ICT? Cell phones, also known as mobile phones or wireless phones, are handheld phones with built-in antennas. Unlike home phones, 
cell phones can be carried from place to place with minimum fuss. This discussion is very interesting. Please before you leave, kindly explain how computer, fax machine and automated teller machine ATM are part of applications area of ICT. For computer, a computer is a programmable machine that inputs, processes and outputs data. A computer system refers to the computer and all its equipment. For fax machine, fax machine is a short form for facsimile machine. It is a device that can send or receives text and pictures, graphics, over a radio broadcast or a telephone line. Automated teller machine is also known as automated banking machine. AB or cash machine is a computerized telecommunication device that provides the client of financial institution with access to financial transactions in public space without the need for a cashier, human clerk or a bank teller. Thank you very much for your time. We are indeed grateful. Mr. M and H. Allahi Ismail have taken us through different application areas in ICT. Teleconference, video conferencing, telepresence, telecommunicating and networking, telecommuting, messaging, information search, retrieval and archival, ICT-based gadgets, mobile phone, computer, fax machine, automated teller machine are well explained. Thank you once again, Mr. M and H. Allahi Ismail. You are welcome Mr. Abdul Kader. Subscribe to Adukam YouTube channel.